Hello, my name is James. Welcome to my channel. And if you follow my previous video about uh, AI tools, uh, Paul is the uh, best uh, uh, artificial intelligence tools uh, I recommend it. And uh, if you don't, please find in my channel and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well. <laughs> okay, thank you. All right, today I'm going to show you how to use um the playground and uh, stable diffusion inside of a pole and also pole can be assistance for you to write the poems for you to use in mid journey okay let's begin first thing first if you are a um how to say a, a newbie to paul uh no need to be panic this is a tool that's so easy to use. You don't need to learn uh, for hours. Just, just get minutes and you will be a pro in Paul. Okay, so uh, there is a search bar. So this is where we uh, type stuff and uh, attach the documents or images or use the wise to controls. Okay, so if by default, we are, will be talking to a robot called assistant. Like where is the capital of USA? And I type return. Then we will be enter this uh, interface where assistant will talk to us directly. The capital of the United States of America is Washington DC. Yeah, correct. And they are uh, relevant answers or questions we can use. And we can give a sum up for this um, answer. And we can also, um, how to say, follow the assistants. So assistants now is one of our robots. And we can talk to him every day. And then we can talk to other bots. For example, like we can talk to Cloud. If you follow my previous video, I already introduced how uh, convenient that the cloud is. And we have uh, two different versions. One is uh, limited access, one is uh, unlimited. So if you are a free user and you're not going to pay any cents in uh, artificial intelligence, you can use this uh, forever. But if you want, wish to use this uh, bot more than once per day, you can subscribe the paw here. But I'm not going to pay today. So uh, let's forget about it. And also remember, this label means you need to pay if you have more questions than more than one. And also for the chat GPT 4 and we can ask uh, a question per day. But you have uh, unlimited access to ChatGPT uh, 3.5. So in this robot, you can talk forever. Like, uh, hey, how are you? Look, the response is quite amazing. It's even faster than the um, na native native uh, ChatGPT, right? Okay. So um, also, we can download the desktop version. Uh, so you will have a client like this. Basically, the same thing to the browser. So they are uh, all, all, need to, all, uh, all that needs you to connect your uh, network. And then um, we have more interesting stuff like the playground. So playground is quite different from uh, all the robots on market. It's quite unique because playground is official robots that can generate images for you. Let's try. And it's totally free. So um, please give me a robot boy in cyberpunk style. I forgot to say thank you. Uh, <laughs> okay, so it says generating images, and uh, we need to wait for more seconds. Okay, 
So now we got this uh, nice images, and the size is quite uh, large, already good enough for us to use in uh, web design or uh, I don't know promotion of your radios. So it's quite quite amazing, right? And speed is quite uh, quite fantastic and uh, satisfying. And uh, can you modify this into a dark background? So if uh, you are a, a newbie to artificial intelligence and you don't want to uh, spend money on it, I think Paul can help. And uh, uh, basically all the uh, chat GPT chat uh, AI and the image generate AI are free in Paul, so which is quite amazing, right? So oh, sorry, I think uh, I think this robot misunderstand me, but <laughs> it's all right. Okay, so this is a robot called a Playground. We can uh, have a new chat, or we can follow this robot. Okay. And what what is more, I think everybody heard the name of stable diffusion, right? This is a um, um, very top level artificial intelligence in generate images area, and the image is quite amazing and quite uh, have a sense of the art, and we also can use uh, stable diffusion in Paul. But uh, to be noticed that some of the uh, advanced settings of the stable diffusion uh, cannot be used inside of the pole. But for example, like the control nets, but you can use it as a beginning, right? So everybody, if you are a beginner of the stable diffusion, you need a place to uh, practice and to, to see what is what, right? So I think it's a perfect tool. For beginners okay so uh give me a panda uh, uh give me a kung fu panda okay uh, so generating images now and already down oh cool <laughs> and uh give me a cyber Punk robot boy. Wow, this is nice, right? And look at the size of the image. Don't forget, this is totally free, and you don't need to have a very high-end computer to running uh, the the localized version of the stable diffusion. All you need is you have the. Uh, a browser, no matter you, if you are running it in your computer, your laptop, or even your uh, mobile device. As long as you can open the poll and you can talk to the robot and it can help you to generate the image, which is fantastic, which is what we need, right? And now we are totally have uh, unlimited access to stable diffusion and we can use uh, uh, another robot called Playground, which is amazing, right? And we can talk to Chat GPT and Cloud. Wow! And do we have more? Do we have more interesting stuff for us to find? Yes. And we have this robot called um, Mid Journey, right? Mid Journey. Okay, but. Remember, you cannot uh, running mid journey inside of the pole. So this tool is help you to um, generate a good palm for you. Like uh, uh, I want to have a kung fu panda. So it will generate the palms for you instead of the directly the images. But sometimes we have the confusion like how to write a good palm uh, so that we can have the better quality of the image, right? So this tool can help. Okay, so now basically you get everything you need, right? And 
you can even create your own bot here. Click the create bot and you have the chance to create your own GPT, your own artificial intelligence. Uh, see, you need to type the name of your robot and change the, the profile image. And um, uh, so we have a base bot. They have uh, many options like chat GPT and the cloud and stable diffusion. I recommend uh, chat GPT or cloud. And then you can use a prompt to create your own robot. Um, I remember like the two months ago, I created a robot that super hates me. So every time I talk to the, this robot and this is an anti-social robot and he have really funny stories to tell. So um, like you can also have the robots that, that's um, like super, have a, have a lot of knowledge about the arts or uh, really funny, right? So we can type like funny and uh, uh, funny and um, uh, community of the community number of the uh, comedian and whatever. So that enables your robots to have the um, really funny personality. And also you can use the uh, knowledge base where you can add the source for the, the knowledge of the robot and you can create a greeting uh, message and uh, basically that's it. And you can write a, a, a profile and uh, then create your own bot. I think this is quite nice. And if you are a, uh, let's say a developer or you are a advanced user, you can use this to create a robot based on your own server. So you basically can create a robot uh, customized robots uh, on this uh, pod and you can sell it you can um, make it um, you can get benefits from it you can earn money from this robots I think it's quite cool right and uh, if you don't want to share if you don't want to uh, earn money you can share to your friends and they can enjoy let's make a joke yeah and uh, all the history that you're talking to your robot will be here. So as long as you didn't delete the, the, the dialogue, you can continue your uh, conversation with your bot. And if you want to delete it, click the three dots and click the delete the chat, then uh, it will be gone. Okay, I think basically that's it. If you create your own robot and you can click uh, creators and you can earn money from it, ah, it's quite, quite nice, right? Okay, I think so much for today. I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to subscribe me. I will bring more information about artificial intelligence and uh, designs and uh, hope you like it. See you next time. Bye bye.